Hello, sports fans, sports betters, and YouTube Nation. John here with Rigget Picks. Uh, sorry this video is so late. Uh, tried to do it last night, but I woke the baby up and uh, went and dealt with that and uh, decided I wasn't going to wake her up again. Uh, problem with my audio when I'm trying to talk soft with my new camera system that I got and the computer, it's, uh, I guess it's hard to hear. So um, now I can be as loud as I want because I'm upstairs at work. And, uh, you know, we're rocking and rolling. It was a good day on Sunday. Uh, Could have been better. As always but um did not have any teasers didn't have any fancy things just went uh you know the, the youtube free, free play hit uh swept the weekend on the youtube free plays but it had the dallas cowboys plus three um also in the video i said i like them to win so call that a bet if you want uh, they're gonna win on the money line they took care of business they beat philadelphia uh the game did go over that was one of my premium plays was the over i uh, mentioned it in the video that i liked it also but um Drake came in for us good, hit good there. And then I had SIU over Evansville, minus nine. Uh, that game, it it didn't hit. Uh, the Evansville was up, or not Evansville, but um, SIU was up nine at the half. And I said, all we got to do is win the second half, and we're in. And then they didn't. So, you know, that, at the end of the day, that was a loss. But all in all, it was a winning day. I was two and two on Patreon, winning, winning. Um, both the big bets hit, both the little bets um, lost. Had a soccer play, uh, very solid numbers to back up the soccer play. It just didn't hit. Um, you know, the one team won for the first time in seven matches, and the other team lost for the first time in six matches, and um, you know, first time in seven matches at home. Just it wasn't in the cards for that one. But for you to play hit. Two and two day, up over a hundred bucks on the day. Um, you guys know I don't really bet that big, so you know that's a that's a good day. That's a good day there. So we're moving forward. We're rocking and rolling. Monday night football: Buffalo Bills, New England Patriots. This game is intriguing. Um, everything says the Bills are going to come in and crush the Patriots and carry on. Patriots are talking about Stratum. I don't know. I don't know. Newton. Stratum, Newton's, you know, he's a quarterback, but he's still, I don't know, he's still just not there. I, I, it's it's all it's all here with him, I think. It's all, you know, he, he, he wants to be, he wanted to be great, wants to be great. He just can't get out of his own shadow sometimes, and, it, and it's scary. Um, Buffalo, what do they got to play for? How important is that number two seed? How important is the number three seed? The AFC is kind of a... Uh, a juggernaut right now. You got uh, three teams that could end up eleven and five. Um, there's the Dolphins, the Browns, the Ravens. I don't know if I want to play any of those in the playoffs. I, I mean, you look at it, and you're like, man, if we're number two seed, and then these guys win, those guys win. You can't predict who you're gonna play if you're the two or three seed. So now, do you just rest your guys? You've already clinched the division. How how much do they play? How hard do they play? You know, wh where does Buffalo go from here is what I'm getting at. You know, where does Pittsburgh go? Where where do any of these teams that have already clinched their division go? They're getting a home playoff game. It's going to be against Buffalo, Cleveland, or Miami. More than likely, there's a couple. I think there's one team that can still sneak in there. But I, the odds are, you know, astronomical for that. But this division uh, is full of juggernauts, and I don't know. I don't want, I don't want to play Lamar Jackson in the playoffs. I don't. Why would you want to do that? Why would you, <laughs> you try to set yourself up and then you're like, oh, they won, they lost. Now we got to play them anyway. So I don't think that you can predict who's going to go where in this division. So um, it's all about what Buffalo wants to do. The, the, these guys played earlier this season. It was 24-21. to 21. Buffalo won the game by three. If you look at the numbers, New England has, you know, they're, they're worse on offense. They're averaging 344 a game to Buffalo's 397, but they're better on defense. Patriots are giving up 355 a game. Buffalo's getting or giving up 369. Um, most of what the Patriots are giving up is uh, through the air, 222 to 133. Buffalo is a pass first team, runs second. Uh, Patriots are kind of mixed. They they run a lot. Buffalo gives up 121 yards a game rushing. Uh, the Patriots are used to getting 145 yards a game rushing. So you know they're not a heavy passing team. Buffalo does allow 248 yards through the air, but I think this game has the makeup to be um, closer than some anticipate. The line right now is seven and a half, which, um, I don't know. 
I don't want to say it surprises me because Buffalo's good. Buffalo's been putting the smack down on a lot of teams late. And, they're, you know, they're, they're proving that, hey, this is our division. It's our time. We're back. We're going to do this again. So, you know, maybe they come out with the chip on their shoulders still. It's, it's hard to tell. But I'm going to do a teaser. I'm going to do a seven-point teaser. Um, I like it. We're going to tease Buff, uh, New England up to 14 and a half. And then we're going to tease the over, I believe it's up to 53. Or not the over, but the under. We're going to tease it up to 53. I think the game's going to go under 53. And um, I think that it's going to stay within 14 and a half points. So I got the Patriots plus 14 and a half. The under at 53. That's how I'm going to roll. Uh, weather's not going to be favorable. It's going to be kind of rainy and sloppy there in New England. So I think that's going to have some effect on the game. That's what I'm going to roll with. I uh, put uh, $44 on it to win, or 52 to win 40 and, uh, you know, it, it's minus 130 juice, but um, we're taking it. That's what I'm going to do. So, if you guys have not already, hit that subscribe button, tap the bell, turn notifications on. As always, leave comments in the comment section about the game. If you have questions about other games, there's not a lot going on today. There's not a lot I like. So, um, you know, I'll have very limited plays over my Patreon, but I will have some regardless of uh, the situation. So, hope you guys have a wonderful Monday. Sorry this video is so late, but, um, you know, family first gotta do what you gotta do so we'll take care of business hope everybody has a wonderful day thank you very much for watching this video and most importantly good luck with your bets